guys happy aloha friday we just got out of costco yes i know i went yesterday but you know what they had tp and they had my love's donuts so a double score um oh god it's hot but he's putting the wagon away and then we're gonna go get something to eat but i'm so glad now we can just kind of yeah we got our toilet paper so at least we don't hoard do you guys hear that it is the first of the month so the sirens go off um as testing so anyways we like i said we went to costco's and we found gold we got what we needed so here buddy picked up some kawaii shrimp this is so ono um more mushrooms because i used a lot yesterday and i just pack them up and then yeah um, I actually saw Melissa from LBZ too. Just ran out of my um, pancake mix, so this is perfect. And like she said, it's a resealable bag, so excited for that. But I pick up more bacon because we are pretty much out. I think this is his poo poo with his when he drinks. So this is really good. And this guy here is the best thing like today's the last day you can get this they said they're not gonna if you get it straight from the loves bakery today is the last day and then but he got some pork belly in here for the weekend or for tomorrow to eat yummy and we got toilet paper so score definitely happy that we were able to get what we needed um like i said we don't hoard but i'm so glad to get that and everybody got some water but it's almost lunch time. Something to eat. Probably. So if you grew up in Hawaii, you probably had these donuts. And like I said, today is the last day to get them. This is like childhood memories and the fact that we're not gonna have it anymore is kinda sad. What if they I just telling my mom they might just bring it back but this and the pog juice i would take this over the pog juice and buddy is the opposite i'm not a fan of pog juice i i don't like guava stuff really like the only like guava thing i probably would eat depends on how it's prepared on a dessert and guava jelly or guava jam and that's pretty much it i guava juice no the fruit itself no it's gross to me so for me pog juice not a fan never was i guess because two i was never a big juice person growing up i mean i guess passion orange like hawaiian sun would be pretty much the juice i drank other than that i don't think i really drank we didn't drink pog all that much or or the other medical drinks like the one in the cartons but um yeah i would prefer to have the donut stay and the pog juice go but whatever it is what it is everybody is like 50 50 people like it people don't so anyway i could just eat that whole box of donuts for lunch and i'd be happy and uh, gradually increase services in these departments um i'm editing now but i've been done with um i was just on a zoom in the zoom meeting um silently with our uh, company they had an all staff meeting and yeah i i was home so it's a good thing i turned and i just wanted to see what they were talking about since like i'm not physically there anymore and i don't know what's really going on um but yeah anyway um i'm not gonna go into detail about it i just that's just what i was doing when you saw me earlier but i'm editing um this week so far i'm gonna try to get it up by today and actually didn't even eat lunch so i'm thinking that we're gonna have an early dinner it's quite windy today which is thankfully like the best thing because i hate being sweaty and hot but um yeah i think we're gonna get dinner early today um and um that just be our friday
could probably eat this whole box by myself hope you guys had a great friday it's the weekend i'm gonna sit there and eat a few more because i'm i think just me and my mom are the only ones that want to eat this and my brother even texted me and he's like what's the open bid for your donuts i'm like sorry bro this ain't for sale this is not for sale anyway guys hope you had a great friday thanks for watching i will see you guys in the next one bye Hey guys, happy Monday. I know I don't ever vlog on a Monday, but I haven't been ending the vlogs. I haven't been really vlogging so much. So I figured that I'll just continue on today and keep vlogging. I don't have anything planned. We are watching Reed Drummond, the Pioneer Woman, and she made like this peanut butter grilled cheese kind of a peanut butter jelly. But he wanted to make paninis for lunch yesterday um, bought me an extra bread this is from Safeway really cheap freshly made sourdough bread it smells so good so I'm gonna make some sandwiches for me and my mom today she just wants hers regular I am gonna grill mine I know it's very unhealthy but I am going to use the secret to like grilling like a grilled cheese and I found that out is using this mayonnaise it really makes it nice and toasty um, one time I made this for Peyton and he was like, I don't want none of that on there. I said, okay. I still used it. Because <laughs> it really makes the bread really nice and toasty. So I like that. Anyway, um, I'm going to add that. And then Buddy bought some... This one. Boar's Head Fiery Chipotle Gourmets. So it's like mayonnaise with like hot stuff in it it's really good um maybe now and then i would probably just use like a dijon mustard like for my mom because it's not spicy this is kind of spicy i had some yesterday and then we had some meat i just packed it back into here because the container was in a resealable container and then we have some cheese but he bought like a gourmet cheese but um i don't really want to touch it so let me go put that together while my pan is heating up and then I'll make my little panini. This is my sandwich. It's not really pretty, but it tastes good. I'm fine. Kind of sounds like I'm at in Chinatown. <laughs> like well? Cutting. Sounds like Chinatown. But he made that in the air fryer. He made le like lechon. Would have been bomb if he made lechon koali. Okay, you can make that tomorrow. I will probably have some tomatoes left. Good morning, guys. Happy Tuesday. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy. Uh, in Hawaii, it's Boys Day. So. Um, actually, I just came back from the store. It's like nine something. I'm normally not even up at this time of the day. Went to the grocery store to buy dinner for tonight. Um, I'm gonna first time making chicken enchiladas. I know it's super simple. You just throw it in the oven and bake it and whatever. So that, and then I'm gonna make my guacamole again. I told was gonna make it on Sunday, but I forgot lime. But I have everything else at home. Anyway, Buddy's home today. That's why I'm in my car. Um, he is not feeling well. Um, no, he doesn't have fever. He doesn't have shortness of breath. Um, and he doesn't have any like body aches. It's just a really upset stomach. Um, everything else is okay. Um, he's just probably dehydrated and whatnot and everything like that. So because nothing is staying. TMI, but anyway, he's home. So I went to the grocery store, picked up a bunch of stuff. Now I'm gonna get him some soup. Nothing is better 
like my grandma always said and which my dad always said when they were sick drink soup so that's what he's doing he's gonna drink soup obviously i'm home now and ugh. What a sad, sad day. I just saw this. There's ants in here. So the last five donuts I cannot eat. It was good while it lasted. So I'm going to have to dump that. Very sad. End of an era. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah. So I am going to put the groceries away. got my spray. And I'm going to go do that. And I'll show you guys what I got. I have meat because I'm going to make gyodon tomorrow. And then since today's single de mom, I'm going to make chicken enchiladas, just like I mentioned. So here's my corn tortillas. I have the diced green chilies there. Um, some dashi stock for the gyodon tomorrow. Sour cream for tonight. Enchilada sauce. I got some green onions. They had the ginger, so of course I had to get it. Um, went to get this one because I like this cheese. Um, we got some local tomatoes, Kamala tomatoes, lime, the guac, some lettuce, and then we got this ramen. So they put a limit onto the Simon, um, but Buddy and I, we like the Sapporo brand, the Sapporo Ichiban. I don't, I'm like told it, I'm not even a top ramen. I can't, I can't even eat that stuff anymore, but I, it has to be Sapporo. Um, so we got the tonkatsu and um, cause you can uh, I guess shrimp miso and then some more shrimp cause there's only a limit of 8 so I just got those 8 cause buddy had asked for them and then in here is some Gatorade for him they were on sale but unfortunately this flavor he wanted there was just one left and it was kind of busted up but he still wanted it so then i got him something else anyway that's the haul i'm gonna put them all the way in the refrigerator and then find me something to eat then uh, i don't know oh yeah i failed to mention that that was from fulan which is a local grocery store and the total cost for all of that stuff was 70 bucks really nice to go at this time of the day and i know it would be you know i have to wait for the kupuna hours which is basically they let the senior citizens go in early um they go in like in the first they're allowed to go in the first hour and um but this is actually a really good time because people are still working you know because and nobody's really there sometimes if you go there um later in the day when everybody's off or whatever then uh yeah you're waiting in a pretty long line okay guys it's already evening time dinner time i kind of had like a slight headache so i kind of just laid low but anyway i made dinner already and it is cinco de mayo as many of you know already um so i made chicken enchiladas first time so simple nothing fancy but here you go here's a chicken enchiladas and then earlier today um, I was watching my friend um, Roxy from Holo Holo Adventures if you're not already following her she's a um, another Hawaii youtuber and she does like lives and she has a family and she her husband's ex-military so you know that always like chimes in for me and she's from Hawaii too so if you not already check her out just check her out just she's so cute um, she did a live this morning while I was doing the live I was making my guacamole so I wasn't as interactive on her live, sorry Roxy, but um, it's because I was also doing guacamole this morning. I made that this morning. So, and um, we bought this the other day and I added, I have it, I already have it out. So I put a little bit of lehi moe in there. I have it on the rocks because I, I don't know if our blender is working and I wasn't about to buy a new one, but um, whatever, it works, still tastes good.